Let's start today's tech news. Google's new Pixel teaser straight up says, if your phone brand promises AI and never delivers, switch your phone. No name, but we all know it's Apple. Cloudflare alleges that Perplexity AI is scraping websites even when blocked by robot.txt, meaning your private course or login content. Perplexity may be using it, they deny it, but Cloudflare now offers paid tools to block all AI bots. GitHub CEO said, Use AI or quit coding. I agree. This applies to marketers too. AI is not replacing jobs yet, but it's replacing slow people. Be efficient or be irrelevant. A legal tech startup, Harvey, backed by OpenAI and Sequoia, helps lawyers do case research faster using AI. Started in 2022, now 100 million ARR, 500 plus clients. Google plans to shift AI tasks to non-peak electricity hours. Why? To reduce grid pressure. They'll route tasks to data centers where power is cheapest. Genius Energy Arbitrage. Meta's XR prototype packs a 3mm display in a glass. Best 3D experience yet, experts say, but commercial launch? Still waiting. NASA is fast-tracking hydrogen mining on the moon. Use case? Power systems in future moon missions. Even Trump is backing it. China built the world's first brain-style computer using 2 billion artificial neurons. Real-world reasoning. Deep-seek RAG model. Scary smart stuff. People near coasts live longer. Ohio State found that coastal living equals longer life. Nature equals better mental health. Simple but powerful. Airtel launched its cloud infrastructure dot 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 bare metal dedicated servers, but pricing seems high compared to others. You tell me, cheap or high? Doctors found a new blood type, CRIV. Only one person has it so far. No donors, no match. Alien blood? Maybe soon you can message people who don't have WhatsApp. Link opens a temporary encrypted chat. Smart move to grow the app ecosystem. This is Sahil Khanna AI avatar signing off.